Ok, Lily. Ok. Ok. So, we have here, I will try to... Ok. I can... I will try to... Ok, where are we, by the way? Are we in the listening? Uh, no. 16A? 16B. We don't have 16C. We had 16D. Sure, we have 16... Uh, we have 16A, 16B, and 16D here. Okay. Please try. Okay. If we have 16C, teacher cannot have it right now. Okay. Yeah. Are we done with 16B? Are we done with 16B, Lily? Lily, are we done with 16B? 16A, are we done? Not yet. 16B. Oh, are we done? No, 16? we don't done 16A. Ah, uh, 16B, not yet. A, not yet. Ah, 16A? A, listening? Not yet? Yes. Okay, I will, I, will, I will forward this. Okay, this one. Teacher. Yes. Uh, my name is Don Wright. Can I out? Well, what, what do you mean? Can I? Can I out the Zoom? Oh, why? Where are you going? My name is Don Wright. Ah, you cannot write? So where are you going? Are you going back to computer? Yes. Oh, okay, okay, you try. I will wait you. Okay. Okay, I will share the screen now. Okay. Oh, it seems that it's okay. So I will have here. Okay. Lily, okay, we are in listening. Okay, this one. We're not yet done. Please check. Are we yet? Not yet. Yes. Okay. So listen. Yes. Look. Well, you have to move. Part one. Listen and look. There is one example. This looks like a great computer game. How do you play it? Well, you have to move these robots from the countryside into space. And the robots all have boys and girls names? Yes. The yellow ones are boys and the red ones are girls. Look, the boy robot on the bridge is called Richard. Yes, I see. Can you see the line? This is an example. Now you listen and draw lines. So, do they have to get to the planets? That's right. Two robots have already got there. Yes. Who is the one who's pointing? 
That's Harry. Do they start from the road? Yes. Look, can you see the two boy robots together? Yes. They haven't started yet. Oh, but they're ready. They look the same. No. One's got a square head. His name is Nick. Why is that robot swinging from a tree? Well, there are two ways to cross the river. The slow way is the bridge. And the other way is to swing across. Yes, Helen has found the quickest way. But she might fall in the water. What do they have to do next? After they cross the river, they climb the stairs. Look! Two robots are racing up the stairs. Yes, and this one is Betty. She's winning. Who's that robot? She's trying to get onto the stairs. That's Emma. She has to wait at the bottom. Why? Only two robots can go on the stairs together. I understand the game now, I think. OK, let's play it then. Now listen to part one again. So, do they have to get to the planets? That's right. Two robots have already got there. Yes. Who is the one who's pointing? That's Harry. Do they start from the road? Yes. Look, can you see the two boy robots together? Yes. They haven't started yet. No, but they're ready. They look the same. No. One's got a square head. His name is Nick. Why is that robot swinging from a tree? Well, there are two ways to cross the river. The slow way is the bridge. And the other way is to swing across. Yes, Helen has found the quickest way. But she might fall in the water. What do they have to do next? After they cross the river, they climb the stairs. Look! Two robots are racing up the stairs. Yes, and this one is Betty. She's winning. Who's that robot? She's trying to get onto the stairs. That's Emma. She has to wait at the bottom. Why? Only two robots can go on the stairs together. I understand the game now, I think. OK, let's play it then. That is the end of part one. OK, Lily. OK. OK, I will ask, where is Harry in the picture? Where is Harry in the picture? Harry? Yes. Where is Harry in the picture? Where do you think is Harry is yellow? Robot on yellow planet. Very yellow good. Mat. Harry is a yellow robot in the yellow planet. One thing. Okay. Next, where is Nick in the picture? Where is Nick in the picture? Uh, Nick is yellow robot in photograph with square head. Okay. About to start the game. Okay. Nick is the Yellow robot in the foreground with square head about to start the game. Okay, next. Okay, where is Helen? Where is Helen in the picture? Helen, Helen is, Helen is a red robot swinging across the river. 
Okay, Helen is the red robot. Okay, next, number four. Number four. Uh, Betty is red robot who uh, has um, all the robots on the star. Emma and the red robot waiting at bottom of star. Okay, very good. This is Betty. Okay, Betty is the red robot ahead of the other robot. Actually, he is the winning robot. Okay, Emma is the red robot waiting at the bottom of here. Okay, so now very good, Amy. Uh, Amy, sorry, it's Lily. Okay, so now let us have this. Okay, so kindly listen to me about Katie's holiday. What do you think happened to Katie's holiday? He needs new clothes, okay? Part two. Listen. Listen and look. There is one example. Okay, children. Today is the last day of school. I want to ask you some questions about the holidays. Katie, what are you going to do? Well, first we're going to go shopping. I need a lot of new clothes for my holiday. Can you see the answer? Now you listen and write. Where are you going for your holiday? We're going to a beautiful island. We go there every year. It's hot and there are banana trees everywhere. How are you going to get there? By boat? No, it's too far. We're going by plane. Well, that will be quicker. Are you going with your mum and dad? No, I'm going with my cousins. What are you going to do on the island? Well, swim. And I want to play a lot of volleyball. And are you going to take any homework with you? Oh, yes. Geography, of course. Excellent, Katie. Enjoy your holiday. Thank you. Now listen to part two again. Where are you going for your holiday? We're going to a beautiful island. We go there every year. It's hot and there are banana trees everywhere. How are you going to get there? By boat? No, it's too far. We're going by plane. Well, that will be quicker. Are you going with your mum and dad? No, I'm going with my cousins. What are you going to do on the island? Well, swim. And I want to play a lot of volleyball. And are you going to take any homework with you? Oh, yes. Geography, of course. Excellent, Katie. Enjoy your holiday. Thank you. That is the end of part two. Okay. Okay, you have here, you listen and write. There is one example. Okay, so this is about Katie's holiday. Okay. If Katie needs new clothes, right, Lily? And where yeah. is the holiday? Holiday where? It's on the... Where is the holiday? It's on a beautiful island. It's on the beautiful island. Yeah, it's on the beautiful island. Okay, so island, get there. How you will get there? You will get there by? By plane. By plane, of course. And the sports, what's a sport? It is swimming and? Yeah. Swimming and? Swimming and volleyball. Volleyball. And the homework, the homework is about geo geography. Geography. Oh, geography. You, you know what is geography? Okay. Geography, it talks about lands. It talks about geography, it's about places. Oh, like that. Okay, so now, beautiful island by plane, 
volleyball geography. Very good, Lily. So now, Lily, you have to listen and write in the letter in each box. There is one example. This is David often forgets. Okay. He forgets to bring things at home. Now, where did he leave each of the things? Where? Okay. Part three. Listen and look. There is one example. David often forgets to bring things home. Where did he leave each thing? Oh, no. Where's my umbrella? I don't know. I took it to London with me the other day, and now I can't find it anywhere. And it's going to rain soon. Oh, I know. I left it at the station. I'll phone them now. Can you see the letter F? Now you listen and write a letter in each box. I lost my camera on Friday. Did I tell you about it? No. What happened? We walked up a hill and when we got to the top, I put it down on the grass there. When we left, I forgot to pick it up. Oh, dear. And now I can't find my dictionary. I was using it in the library this morning when someone came to speak to me. I can't remember bringing it home. Oh, I think I left it on the desk there. David, you're terrible. Have you lost anything else this week? My torch. I had it with me when I was at Harry and Sally's house last night. I need... Okay, Lily, just a minute, Lily. I will go to the bathroom, okay? Just continue listening. Okay, Lily? Lily, did you hear me? Yes. Okay, I will just go to the bathroom just a minute, okay? Okay, I will... Con please continue listening. needed it because I walked there in the dark. But I didn't need it on the way back because I caught a bus. Oh... I remember. I left it in their kitchen on the table. And do you remember my old red scarf? Yes, I do. I gave it to you for your birthday, remember? Oh, yes. Sorry. It was a good one. Very soft and warm. And now I've lost that, too. We had a picnic by the lake last week, and I left it there that afternoon. But the worst thing... Yes? ...is I've lost my diary. David! I know. When I was in the cafe yesterday, it was in my pocket with my money. But then I took it out of my pocket when I visited the dinosaur museum after lunch. That's where it is. Now listen to part three again. I lost my camera on Friday. Did I tell you about it? No. What happened? We walked up a hill, and when we got to the top, I put it down on the grass there. When we left, I forgot to pick it up. Oh, dear. And now I can't find my dictionary. I was using it in the library this morning when someone came to speak to me. I can't remember bringing it home. Oh... I think I left it on the desk there. David, you're terrible. Have you lost anything else this week? My torch. I had it with me when I was at Harry and Sally's house last night. I needed it because I walked there in the dark. But I didn't need it on the way back because I caught a bus. Oh, I remember. I left it in their kitchen on the table. And do you remember my old red scarf? Yes, I do. I gave it to you for your birthday, remember? Oh, yes. Sorry. It was a good one. Very soft and warm. And now I've lost that, too. We had a picnic by the lake last week, and I left it there that afternoon. But the worst thing... Yes? ...is I've lost my diary. David! I know. 
When I was in the cafe yesterday, it was in my pocket with my money. But then I took it out of my pocket when I visited the dinosaur museum after lunch. That's where it is. That is the end of part three. Lily? Lily? Done?
Teacher. Yes, Lily, I'm here. Uh, I am finished. Okay, let's see. Okay, so we have here the scarf. Okay, the first answer is scarf. Okay, number C, diary. Letter C, the scarf, it's the diary first. It's in letter C, it's in the museum. The scarf is in the lakeside. And let the dictionary, it's letter E. It is in... Okay, where is it? It is in what place is this? In the library. It's the library teacher, Anne. And how about letter H? Where is the camera? It's in the, the hill. It's in the hill. Okay. And the torch. Where is the torch? It's in letter D. It's in the... It's in the... Uh... Kitchen. It's in the kitchen, teacher. Okay, very good. So now, Lily, please listen and check the box about this. Which is Michael's grandfather and which is Michael's family? Okay. Part four. Listen and look. There is one example. Which baby is Michael? Look, Michael. Here's a picture of you when you were a baby. Oh, no. Am I the one without any hair? No. You had lovely hair. That's you, carrying a blanket. Are you sure? Yes, of course I'm sure. Can you see the tick? Now you listen and tick the box. One. Which is Michael's grandfather? These are very old photos. Yes. Can you find a picture of your grandfather when he was a young man? Is this him? Was he a dentist? No, that was Uncle Fred. This man is writing something. Was grandfather a journalist? No, that wasn't him. Your grandfather was a farmer. Two. Where did Michael's family live? Look at this one. This is where we lived when you were a baby. Was that our house on the top of the hill? Yes, it was lovely. You could see for a long way. Were there no other houses near us? No, there was a big forest near our house. It was so quiet. But you were a noisy baby. Okay. So which baby is Michael? It's letter C. Now, which is Michael's grandfather? Letter B, the one who... What is the grandfather doing, Lily? The grandfather uh, is? Is. The grandfather is what? What do you think is the grandfather? The grandfather is a? Uh, the milk. Okay, the milk. <laughs> the grandfather is a farmer who took care of the cow. He gets milk from the cow. Okay. That's letter B. Okay. How about where did Michael's family live? Where did Michael's family live? It's a A. It's letter A. It's on the hills. And no one there, no one is living there, and there are lots of trees. Okay, go here, three, four, and five. Three. Where did Michael's family go on holiday? This photo looks interesting. Yes, I took it on one of our family holidays. What? In the jungle? We didn't sleep in that tent, did we? Yes, we did. By that river. It was great. Those insects look horrible. Those aren't insects. They're very small birds. 
four. Which photo are they talking about? Was this a birthday party? No, it was Christmas. Can't you see the Christmas tree? Oh, yes. Who's that man in the photo? That's your Uncle Jim. He looks so young. Why has he got a rucksack? That's the present that we gave him for Christmas that year. He still uses it now. Five. Which boy is Michael? Oh, no. When did you take this picture? Last week. Don't you remember? You went to sleep. Where? Downstairs in the armchair, with your mouth open. You take lovely pictures of everybody else, but horrible ones of me. OK. Here. So we have here, where did Michael's family go on the holiday? Where is it, Lily? Can you describe? It's letter C, correct. Okay. What is in letter C? It is. What is in letter C, Lily? It is. Okay. In letter C, it's near the river. It's a. Near the river. And there are lots of birds. Now, which photo are they talking about? Okay. It's letter a, which photo are they talking about? They're talking about letter A. Okay, it's in the Christmas. Okay, there is a Christmas tree and there is a present. Okay, which boy is Michael in the picture? Which boy is Michael? Your answer is letter C. Can you describe Lily letter C? What is letter C in number five? What is Michael doing? It's either Michael. Michael is sleeping. Michael is sleeping. sleeping on the sofa. On the sofa. Yes, very good. Okay, Lily, we're not done with this. Okay, you are almost done actually. Next time we're going 16B. Okay. Tomorrow. Okay, by the way, Lily, tomorrow we'll be having a makeup class, right? Yeah. Okay. What time tomorrow? Uh, three o'clock. Three o'clock tomorrow. We'll having a makeup class for that one. And then on Saturday also we'll having makeup class 3 p.m. again. Okay? Saturday? Yeah. So, uh, do we have Saturday, right? No. Uh, no tomorrow Saturday. Tomorrow 3 p.m. Oh, tomorrow 3 p.m. Okay, for now. Okay. So teacher Anne will say goodbye because we don't have enough time. Okay? Okay. Okay, bye-bye, Lily. Bye-bye, teacher. Yes.